and welcome to OBS Setup and Stream, your easy guide to OBS Studio for crafters. I'm Anthony Miss from Mixed Media, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install a really useful plugin called Transition Table. If you like the contents of this video, please click on the like button and subscribe to my channel. Hit on the notifications button as well. This will notify you of all brand new content that I upload to my YouTube channel. Right, so before we get started, an important thing here is to make sure OBS Studio is shut down whilst installing the plugin. So using our favorite search engine, we're gonna go and hunt for this particular plugin. So simply type in OBS transition table. Okay, and then click on the return button and then that will take you to the results. So go to obsproject.com and click on the transition table link there. That will then take you onto the download page of transitions table. You can have a look and see what the plugin actually does, but what we're wanting to do for the moment is just simply download that particular file. Go on to this one here. There's all the different formats for all the different types of operating systems. We want the Windows one, so we're gonna click on the download there. That shouldn't take too long to download. And there we go. So just go bottom left of your screen, right click, show in folder, then that will take you to the location on your computer. Once you're there, okay, just click on the install twice and it brings up this one, which is the installer. Double click on that one. And then you have this, it's Windows Protect Your PC. Don't worry about that. Click on more info, followed by the run anyway button. This is another plugin that is totally safe to be downloaded onto your operating system. Okay, so just give it a few short seconds for the installation window to come up. Okay, there it is there. So you don't need to worry about the destination folder where it's going to be installed. Just leave that totally alone. Click on the next button. It will tell you that the folder that already exists for OBS Studio and would you like to install it anyway? You want to click on yes. Again, just leave that as a default where the location is going to be. Click on next once again and then that will start to install on your computer and that little green line will quickly run across your screen. Okay, so that's nicely installed. Now we're going to head on over into OBS Studio. Once there, we're going to go up to the toolbar at the top, click on Tools, go on to this one here. There's Transition Table. Click on that one and hey presto, we have it installed. I'll be explaining how to use Transition Table in another video. If you like the contents of my videos, please click on the like button, subscribe to my channel and hit on the notifications button. This will allow you to be notified of all brand new content that I upload to my YouTube channel. Right, okay, so that's it for this video. Join me again soon and thanks for watching.